today in uh, Madison, New Jersey. We're gonna help the owner of this house to remove all the walks. If you guys see right here, the big difference, there was a central rock right here and all this space is dark, darker than this, is because when they were cleaning the floor, they were using uh, those rejuveniles or those uh, shiny acrylic wax on the floor without cleaning it. So that's the reason why it's causing all this. So it's a layer of wax here, all this. I want to show you the area. It's a 1,200 square feet. This is the kitchen. You guys can see the big difference. Look at this. Look at this. This area with this, this area right here. Look at this. So what it is, is just the wax. We need to remove all the wax here. All the wax here, that's another one. All the area. Boom, and we're gonna apply the professional floor finish. The floor is gonna look beautiful after we finish. All this area right here has wax. So that's what we're gonna do today, guys. 1200 square feet, we're helping the owner. The house is already in the list for selling. He's gonna sell the house. So he doesn't wanna go. He thought that he had to sand the floor. And um, there's an option, but technically we can, what we're gonna do is improve the look of the floor to 70 to 80% better than what it is right now. So you don't have to go through the process of uh, sanding. The cost is different, of course, sanding it to between eight to 10 dollars per square foot our services is just removing wax and refinishes two dollars and fifty cents no brainer so definitely you want to go to the road if you're in a budget remember we are not going to put the floors 100 percent looking better if you want to be 100 percent then you need to sand it but it's going to look 70 to 80 percent much better definitely much better than what it looks right now so i want to show you the other area so this is a process that's with the service we offer um here so Okay, look at this. I'm gonna put a call color correction right here to blend it. He knows that we're gonna do that. All this area. Look at this. So guys, you're gonna have a better view after we finish. It's gonna look amazing. Amazing. So uh, stay with me. Take a look how we can save your wood floor and we can make this floor look much better and uh, clean the wax and everything with, and then just uh, with a professional floor finish. This, this floor is, 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 is a good candidate for a screen and recoat. He doesn't want to spend too much money like I said before. So we're going to make the floors look better and just wax it and remove the wax and put a, a new wax on the floor. Okay, guys, so stay tuned. Keep watching. We're here with the team, Coco and Alberto. We're going to do all this job, 200 square feet here in Madison, New Jersey. So don't forget to subscribe. And Keep watching. Keep watching. All right, we are in the living room. I'm gonna show you guys how the kitchen ended up. Oof, look at this. Wow. Look at that. And where it was before? You kidding me? Hey, look at this. Look at this. Yeah. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, I want to show you how we look, how we just with my foot. How I'm removing the wax on this floor. Whoa, man. A lot. Look at this. Look at this. This is how much wax you put in your floor. See this. See this right here. So you gotta be careful when you buy those products from Home Depot. Quick Shine, Rejuvenize. That's what it does to your whole floor. Exactly. And you don't want to do that. Look at that. Look at this. I'm sorry. Look at this. Look at this. Just with my feet. Look at this. So look at this dark spot. It should be looking like that. And we're going to get there. 
Okay, removing all of this. We're using a uh, solution to remove all this wax from magic wand. And uh, yep, my right, guys, stay tuned. So that's what we're gonna do to save your floors. Look at this. Almost the same color now. Excellent, excellent. So this mark right here. Look at that. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Look at that. We're removing it. Look at that. Huh? Alright guys. Now you know. Now you know. Alright guys, stay tuned. Keep watching. Over the screen to that part over there. We do the same thing. Alright guys, we working. The team is working. Look at this. Alberta over there with the tornado, rings in that area, the kitchen is looking awesome. Coco is right there with one hand, handling the 175. <laughs> and I'm here in the living room. All right, guys, keep watching. Look at this, guys, look at this. Now we're removing all that dirt compared with the black spot over there. Oh, man. That's what we're doing, all this wax, we remove all this wax from this kitchen, incredible, so much wax. Alright guys, keep watching, that's what we do. Save your wood floor, we're saving your wood floor, remember, we can just make it look better. We're not screening and recoat, it's just removing all the wax and then applying our, our professional floor finish, which is a protection on top of that. So all this wax you can remove. So be careful when you use those um, rejuveniles, quick shine on your floor because this is what's gonna happen. All right, all right, guys, stay tuned, keep watching. All right, guys, look at this floor. Now we strip in the kitchen. All the wax. Look at this, all, all, all that we're removing from here, from this kitchen. So much wax, you have no idea. Wow, guys, look at that over there too. Alright, if you're watching, you're checking, you guys will see. Boom. We rinse in the floor at this point. And this side, the bird was using the tornado after the agitation. Here we're going to let it dwell for another uh, 50 to 20 minutes. So that way uh, the stripper is going to work on this wax. And then um, we're going to do the same process like we're doing here. So this area is going to be ready. This After Alberta cleans this, this area is going to be ready for uh, professional floor finish. Amazing. Yep, look at that. After the tornado looks amazing. Alright guys, stay tuned. Keep watching. Alright guys, we going to apply the second coat on this wood floor. Watch removal and refinishing. Look at this. Oh man, amazing. Look at this. Coco's applying the second coat. It's gonna look awesome. Look at this. Wow, this is the area. This is the second coat. And then, look at this. Look at this area. Wow, the kitchen looks amazing. All this area looks amazing. All right, so we're gonna put the second coat. Pretty much we're finished here, guys. This is what we do. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna know how we do, how we can save your floor how we can remove the wax, how we can screen and recoat, how we can clean and buffer. Don't forget to subscribe, let us know. This is the results for the whole uh, process. And the, the, the other areas are looking, looking much better too. It's trying. This floor definitely needs, like I said before, it needs screen and recoat, but the, um, the owner doesn't want to spend too much money on this one, he said. I mean, it needs to be sanded. There's a lot of damage, a little damage over there, over here, but oh, looks much better. Look at this. It's not 
is 70 to 80 percent better definitely yes 70 to 80 percent better on this area so again this is a process to save your floor if you don't want to go through the road uh, uh, to sand the whole whole area all right guys check our pictures before and after this is amazing amazing job that we did is a uh, results are amazing look at this new floor new floor all right like i said before we're gonna apply the last coat and then uh let it do it for another 30 minutes 20 to 30 minutes and then and then one more and then that's it all right guys i'll see you in the next one